This is the Ben Franklin store. This is Howard. How long you been here working there here? Uh, 49 years. Wow. And you decided uh, to put a place called Neptune's Cellar in the basement here. So you got a hobby shop, all these awesome things, models. Look at this Titanic model. This is crazy. Look at this thing. Ted wow. Ben. It's huge. One two hundred scale. That's insane. And it's lighted. And it's lit up and everything with LEDs. Look at that, buddy. So we're going to go in. We're going to check it out. We're going to look at some of the models, look at some of the things you have here, and also check out the uh, seller here and check out the fish. It's really cool coming to these kinds of places because they have like a bunch of old stuff you can't find anywhere else. Right, right, right. Let's look around at some of these like sculptures and that too. Got a lot of these old sculptures. Sculptures kind of spread throughout the place. Lots of really cool stuff. And one of the things that we like when you look at stuff like this is you can actually see it and touch it. When you buy it online, you don't really know what you're getting. You know, this is $9.99 here, right? How cool is that, buddy? Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. You know exactly what you're getting. And that's why it's cool to come to these older LFSs is because you can kind of see Here's some really cool stuff here. Heaters. Yeah. Look at this stuff. Lots of awesome rocks and driftwood. Check out some of this old gravel here. This is kind of neat. This is a lot of people don't remember that they used to sell smaller gravel. It's almost like sand. Isn't that neat? It's kind of cool. That can be hard to find in colors. So I got a lot of that kind of stuff here plants and stuff we're gonna look around here a little more look at all these backgrounds they have here look at all the different backgrounds I love this posed by the feet that's awesome look at this like a lightning I really like that that is super cool Jeez, dude. that's pretty awesome I'm gonna have to get that so neat. Look at that. that was my, I had one of these chests in my first tank. I think everybody did. You have an awesome store here. How long have you been working here? Well, quite a while. Probably 49 years. <laughs> That's a long time, huh, buddy? Yeah. Seeing as you're 12, huh? Well, yeah. So this place is this basically the basement of the Ben Franklin, kind of like a hobby shop kind of store, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's an awesome place. We're going to shoot some footage up there too. But you guys got some great tanks and some really cool stuff. I really, really like this, what I was talking to Jack about. A lot of these kind of things are even hard to find. You got like all this stuff here, like all these different pumps. And it's kind of cool when you're looking for stuff that you can actually physically see it, touch it, size it up. As compared to like when you buy something online, it's like you don't even really know what you're getting, you know. That's one of the things that I miss about these kind of stores. I'm going to shoot some of the tanks here. Lots of really awesome tanks. Oh, got a gold barometer there. I always like those. Got some puffers. Yeah, I want to show this um, vampire pleco here. Look at this guy. What a cool dude. Looking right at us. Got some yellow labs in there. Some Africans. We have some amazing pieces of driftwood here. I'm actually getting one. Check this one out. I'm getting a rock. And I'm getting this like blonde piece here. I really like that. Super cool. Look at that one. That's awesome. Lots of great cichlids there. Super cool. I was talking before about the gravel over there. Some of these colors and stuff you can't even find anymore, you know? It's really kind of yeah. cool to, to see those. Yeah. Bunch of bait over there. This tank's pretty awesome, too. Get this tank here. Very cool. Look at these guys. Blackmore. Cool little dudes there. Tails, angels, a lot of things all mixed together. Very neat. There's some little baby angels. Look at these guys. Oh, they're so little. Hey guys. 
<laughs> they are cute. Very, very cool. There's some koi. Some awesome koi. Wow, look at them, huh? Hey, guys. They're so cute. down here. Some other tetras and danios, some bluefish. Red caps. Look at these guys. Got a lot of babies, which is neat. You can buy a lot of these as babies. There's a tank of convicts here. Really cool dudes. Here's some more Shabunkin. Sarasa. Shabunkin, very cool. Very cool. Look at the sculpture in the middle of this tank. How cool is that? And some discus in here. I'm hiding out, little guys. And this big old Oscar down here by himself. Hi there. Look at you, buddy. Hi. What a beauty. You want to turn for me? Look at you. Made himself a nice little hole there in the middle. <laughs> what a beauty. What a beauty. 49 bucks. Mean, it says. Oh, maybe not. Maybe you're not mean. You just need some friends. I am very likely going to have to buy this tank, buddy. This is a... What are we going to use it for? Well, we'll use it for a future project, but... This is a 15 tall. It was used for hermit crabs. Never had water in it has a tiny little melted area there from a light, but other than that, pretty awesome shape. Um, very unique, could be used for like a ledge or something because it's so thin. I really like that idea. I think I'm gonna get that. If we don't end up using it for us, we'll use it for somebody else, but that is really, really cool. Very nice shape if it gets cleaned up. I'm gonna be able to talk them down a little more. <laughs> so who's got a big insert like that, buddy? Larry D does. Yeah, he's pretty cool. Yeah. He's one of the guys we we are friends with on YouTube. He's got a big old castle like that. Lots of cool tanks. Very cool sculptures and stands. Very cool. Very nice. Look at this. Oh, look at this guy. Huh? This is a girl. A little girl, you said? Yep, a little girl. Wow, look at that. <laughs> look at that face. So you guys have all kind of things here too, like chinchillas and all kind of different All kinds of small animals, yep. Really neat, really neat. Oh, she wants to, she says, hi. <laughs> all right, we done? Later. We're yeah. done, here we go, girl. What a cutie. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, you're welcome. We're gonna take a little walk through here just to show some of the other stuff he's got, but tra big old train sets, we're gonna show all this stuff. Very, very cool. He has a lot of people that come here even a hundred miles, he said they drive to come and take a look at all the models that he has here. He said he gets a lot of retired folks who have more time on their hands now looking for a good, healthy hobby. And a lot of them will go downstairs and do the fish keeping stuff and have tanks, but then also have, you see up here, he's got a lot of train stuff. And then they'll also have train sets and some of them have train sets with like aquariums incorporated in the train set. And some of them use some of the train stuff for their aquariums. Isn't that a cool idea? Like all in one store, huh? He's got everything here, man, doesn't he? Yeah. Look at these old models, man. Mini pool table. Look at the Munster's house. And then he's got some new stuff here. Oh, I have that. Yep. Look at these guys. The mini pool table. Star Wars stuff. All kind of games. That's this fine. is such a neat place. We could spend hours in here, huh, buddy? Oh, yes, I probably would. <laughs>